Here I just want to highlight a feature on Moodle, a new question type. Um, this question type allows you to have multiple blanks in a question with drop down menus for them to select the answer. This question type is called select missing words question. So I'm going to make uh, a new question. Um, question text. Um, Dr. Seuss has a famous book titled The Cat in the Hat. Okay. Now, what do I want to do to make this blank? So I want to turn the cat and hat into, uh, into blanks uh, for answers. So down here I have all the different choices. So I have different choices and on the side groups. The groups would be the different drop down menus. So all the answers that are in group one are in a single drop down menu. So let's say the first one cat, dog, fish, horse. Next, I want to make a blank for hat. So here is group two hat. Shorts, C, farm, shirt, and change all these to group two. All right, now I have my drop down menus for group one and group two. Now I want to assign the right answers. So choice one has the right answer. So I make double brackets and one. That means for this blank, the correct answer will be choice one. And for this one, double brackets and hat is choice five. So I put in there a five. So Moodle knows that uh, whatever group the correct answer is for one, it'll put all those in the drop down menu, those choices. And same for the second blank. So I'm going to make this, since there's two blanks, default out of two points, not one and save changes. Now let's preview the question. Here's the question. Dr. Seuss has a famous book titled The Blank and it allows me to choose and I can choose cat in the C and let me check the answer and it gave me a one out of two because I got half of it correct. Great new question feature. Start again. The cat in the hat. Check. Perfect.